So today we're out here in the cornfield looking at uh, how to take a good sample uh, uh, when sampling uh, corn tissue. Here we've got our, our indicator plants. The first thing you want to do when you get to the field is go ahead and stage. So we're going to look at uh, the number of uh, collared leaves we have on the plant. Starting down with the brace roots. Probably one or two, maybe three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, possibly ten leaf corn here. When we're taking the tissue sample, we want to go ahead and sample the uppermost collared leaf. Uh, so we're looking for the visible collar. Uh, this would be our plant right here. We can see the, the visible collar right here on the plant. So as we take the sample, there's no need to cut or, or anything, and we just want to take the, the leaf and simply snap it off. So then we have our leaf here. We're going to fold it in half. And place it in our sample bag. Now for proper sampling, we want to be able to collect 15 to 25 leaves across the field. So as, as we move, we want to make sure we incorporate different planter passes, different fertilizer application passes. And for the purposes of, of sampling, we want to probably stay away from the edge. That way we don't get any starting or stopping of starter fertilizer or, or shut off when we're fertilizing the field. So we'll go take some, a few more samples here. We've got our 15 leaves, we've got our information filled out in our plant bag, so it's time to head to the lab. Samples can be dropped off at the lab during normal business hours or after hours in our drop boxes located in the front. You may also mail or ship samples to the lab. Please see our website warlab.com for more information. For more information about plant testing or any of the other testing items we do at the lab, please visit wardlab.com.